Hey everyone! I've placed some useful tools and discount offers in the description section, so be sure to check those out to make your website more professional and successful. Today I want to talk about a common issue that many web developers face when using Infinity Free Web Hosting, the dreaded 403 error. Don't worry though, I'm here to help you fix it quickly and easily. First let's understand what a 403 error is. Essentially, it means you don't have permission to access the requested resource. This can be super frustrating, but there are a few common reasons why you might encounter this error on Infinity Free. Reason number one, incorrect file permissions. If your files aren't set to the correct permissions, your server might block access. To fix this, log into your Infinity Free file manager, find the problematic file or folder, right-click and set permissions to 644 for files and 755 for directories. Reason number two, Taxes file issues. The HA Taxes file controls many aspects of your website, and a small error in this file can lead to a 403 error. Check your .it Taxes file for any incorrect configurations or syntax errors. Sometimes simply renaming your .8 Taxes file to a Taxes underscore old can resolve the issue, allowing you to start fresh. Reason number three, IP blocking. Sometimes your IP might be blocked by the server. You can easily check this by going to your account's control panel and looking for IP blocking settings. Make sure your IP isn't listed there. And finally, reason number four, index files. Ensure you have a proper index file like index.html or index.php in your root directory. Without an index file, your server doesn't know what to display, resulting in a 403 error. That's it. With these steps, you should be able to resolve the 403 error on Infinity Free quickly. Remember to check the description for some awesome tools and discounts to enhance your website. Thanks for watching and happy coding.